Hi, uh, can you hear me? Yes. Yes, okay, great. So, hi, my name is Teacher Donna. What is your name? Um, my name is Yo. Your name is? Yo. Yeah, hi, you. nice to meet you. How are you today? Um, You're good? <laughs> yes? Yes. Okay, great. How old are you? Um, uh, I did. Yeah. 18. Okay. So where are you now? Are you at home? Yes. Um, at home. Ah, uh, so you are having online classes? Yes. Yes, I see. Okay. So since this is our first time to talk, can you tell me something about yourself? Okay, introduce yourself. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, um, introduce, uh, introduce yourself. Uh, um. So tell me about yourself. So my name is, and then my name I is, am. Uh, you and uh, there are four people in my family. Um, comes it. Um, my father, my, my sister, my uh, mother, and me. Okay. So your sister is younger or older than you? Um, yeah. Uh, my sister is younger. Younger. How old is she? She is um, 15 years old. 15 years old, I see. Okay, great. Um, what are your hobbies? Or what do you do in your free time? Uh, your hobbies? Yes, um, I'm a play ram with uh, my brain. And, you uh, play? Play ram. Rams. Okay. Drums? Ram, yeah, that game. Ram, video game. Ah, video games. Okay. Yes. What yes. kind of video game? Um, the uh, oh, who B &B. is he? Oh my God! Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay no problem it's okay who is he your cousin um my um, um i don't talk uh, about uh, you don't talk about um, yeah. ah, i see okay Okay. Said that. So you play video games. What kind of video games? Uh, uh, survival and uh, the survival. Okay. And, yes, yes. I see. So other than playing video games, what else do you do? Mm. With my friend, my friend and my sister. Uh huh. Yes. So there, good. So now, are you in uh, high school or are you a university student? Uh, I, uh, I, uh, study. The uni university. University. What are you studying or what are you taking up? Mm. Me medical. Me Me medical. Medicine? Fibrocat. 
study medical. Medical? Yes. Medical. So you study medicine. So you will become a doctor? Yes. Wow. I will become a doctor. Wow, that's good. Why do you want to become a doctor? Mm, uh, I have everyone. Have so that you can help everyone. Okay. But yes, yes. If you will become a doctor, what kind of doctor or what's your specialty? Are you a doctor for kids or for the heart, for the eyes? So what doctor? I want doctor for the height. Mm -hmm. High height. Doctor for? High Heart? Yes, yes. Heart? Heart? Yes, yes. yes. <laughs> I want. Oh, okay. Why? Why do you want to become a heart doctor? Why? Because uh, um, it's, it's button. This mm -hmm. is button. Quan trọng, quan trọng. Uh -huh. I don't, I don't talk about. So you want to become a cardiologist, yes. right? Yes. So a doctor for the heart. Ah, okay. Uh, is your mom or your dad a doctor? Are they doctors? No. My mom. Um, my mom. No. Your mom is? No, I don't know how to My mom. Yes. Uh, your mom well, is a housewife and your dad yes. what does he do? Uh, my dad's a công nhân viên chức em không biết nói sao nữa. What is that? I don't talk about uh if you don't a worker, okay. Yes, yes. If you don't okay, so if you don't know the English word, you can type it in Vietnamese and I can translate it for you. Okay. Okay. So your mom is a housewife, your dad is a worker. So you want to become a doctor so that you can help people, right? Yes. Yeah. But isn't it um, when you study to become a doctor, it's difficult and it will take you long years, right? Right. Uh -huh. So you think you can do it? Yes, I can do it. Very good. Okay. You are in your what? First year? Second year? What year are you in? I I first year. You're in first year. Okay. Yes, freshman. Freshman. That's right. You're a freshman. So, for example, you will become a doctor. So, would you want to work only in Vietnam or do you want to become a doctor also in another country? I want to work only in Vietnam. Why? Uh, uh, near family. Ah, you want yes. to be near your family. Yes. I see. Okay. So, if you will be working to become a doctor, meaning to say you will not have, now you're still freshman, right? But... When you will become a sophomore or junior or senior, so you will become very busy. Meaning to say, you need to give up playing playing video games. Is that okay with you? Yes, like, I need okay. to stop it. It's okay. <laughs> I see. Okay. okay. So that's good. So I want to ask you, why do you also want to study English? Like, what's your reason? Why do you study English? Uh, because um, I very bad English. Bad. You're very bad? Yes. Ah, okay. So does it mean when you were studying in 
primary school or secondary school, you did not use English? Yes, I did not use English. Mm, I see. So that's why you want to improve your English skill, right? Yes, exactly. Yes, that's right. Because, of course, once you will become a doctor, it would be better if you can also speak in English, right? Yes, yes. Yes, okay. Oh, by the way, where are you staying now? Are you in the north or the south side of Vietnam or in the central Vietnam? Uh, are you in Hanoi right or now, Ho Chi Minh? Oh. I, I, um, I live in Yangs. Where is that? Which part of Vietnam is that? I live in Yang. Okay, so that is a southern Vietnam. Oh, you are near Cambodia? Yes, yes, Cambodia. Near Cambodia, right? And it lies in the Mekong Delta. Oh, okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, where are you studying? Where I do you study, study in I study in, in uh, Ho Chi Minh City. Ah, but now you are in your hometown. Yes. So how far is your hometown to Ho Chi Minh City? How far is that? Uh, very, very far. Very, very far. So meaning to say you are renting a house in Ho Chi Minh? No, I uh, rented a house in Ho Chi Minh. Y you what? Where do you stay in Ho Chi Minh? I stay in uh, Quận Mười. What is that? You can type it in Vietnamese and I'm going to translate it for you. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Because you said your hometown is far, right? What's this? Okay, hold on. What? Why? <laughs> What's wrong? District 10. You're staying in District 10. Yes. But... Is that your house or are you renting? Uh, you are renting. You are renting, okay. Uh, you are renting just you, only one, or you have friends? Uh, I live renting with my friend. With your friend. How many are you? Uh, two friends. So there are three people in the house, right? Yes. Your two friends, they are also in the same province or the same place as you? The same uh, provision. Ah, okay. So there. But now, uh, since there's pandemic and Ho Chi Minh is, I don't know if it's still in lockdown, so you went back to your hometown, right? Yes. So, when will you go back to Ho Chi Minh again to study? Yes. When? When will you go back? Um, I think... Uh, New Year. After New Year. Mm. Yes. Yeah, because I read an article that Ho Chi Minh will open schools maybe in January 2022, right? Or maybe after that holiday, right? Yes, right. Yes, I see. Okay, I understand. So, since you're studying medicine, is it easy to study online or it's better to go to school to study? I study online. Do you like it or... It's not good. It's not good. <laughs> okay. Why? Why is it not good? Uh, content teacher 
Uh -huh. Teacher. Tương tác với giáo viên. Tương tác với giáo viên. You can type it. It's okay. Just type it. Yes. Okay, then I'm gonna translate it so that I can understand. Okay. So you said, ah, the interaction with the teacher is. Wait. Yes. Ah, it's difficult to interact with the teacher. Okay, so you could say. It's difficult to interact yes, with it's the teachers. Okay. So, how many are you in one class? How many people are in one class? Go mm. for us. For Four. Yes. Four classes, but how many students in one class? One hundred sixty. There's a lot. One hundred sixty. Yes. Really? Yes. Why so many? <laughs> okay, one hundred sixty. So. You prefer going to school to study, right? Right. I see. Okay. Um, for example, because here in my country, people cannot study medicine right away. So you cannot study medicine right away. If you're a freshman, you can either study first nursing or pharmacy or biology and then after that after you graduate four years you can study medicine or you can study to become a doctor so in vietnam you can study medicine right away uh, for example like this okay yeah uh, for example me i want to be a doctor okay but in my country, I cannot become a doctor right away. If I'm freshman, okay, if I'm freshman, I need to study first courses related to medicine, like nursing or oh, I, pharmacy, I like that. So, how about in Vietnam? In Vietnam, you can study medicine right away. I can study medicine. Um, hiếm tối đây. I start study um, new month. Yeah. No, học ngành y đa khoa chị ơi, em biết dưới sao So you said Sixth year. Sixth ah. Year. Fifth or sixth? Yes. Sixth, fifth. Sixth. A sixth, I see. 
Okay, I understand. Yeah, because you cannot you cannot study medicine right away. Same in my country. Okay. But isn't it it's difficult to become a heart doctor? Like it's this to become a cardiologist, right? It's difficult, right? Right. But you want to become a cardiologist. Okay. Yes, I I want to still want to. You still want to do it. Okay, that's good. So you said also that your English is not that good, right? Yes. So do you help yourself improve your English skills? Yes, I want to. You have me improve. I will help this. you. Okay. Yes. yes. Why not? I can help you. But for example, at home, do you read English books? Yes. yes. I've read what kind, book. what kind of book do you read? Um, read and in, in the time. Mm -hmm. vocabulary a vocabulary do you also use applications like elsa what what are those applications that you use for vocabulary do you use it no i use no. it you don't use it okay how about do you watch english films uh Yes, mm -hmm. but uh, very, very uh, uh, um, not often, very rare, yes. right? Okay, do you listen to English songs? Yes, I uh, sometimes, sometimes listen. listen. Okay, what English songs do you listen to? Yeah, what song? I song um, Lily and Say mm -hmm. So. Okay, I see. I understand. So now in, uh, in college or in your university, do you use English or no? In university, I use English. You use English, okay, to to talk to talk to your friends or English for so that you need it for school. Yes. Mm -hmm. I see. Okay, I understand. So there. So since you have online classes. What time can you study English? If, for example, I will help you improve your English skills, what time can you study with me? I, I can study with me every time. Every time? Yes. Okay. But, but you have online classes too, right? What time do you study online? Um, uh, yeah, your class. What time does it start? It starts uh, the Cambo. It starts at what time? Tomorrow. No, I mean your your subjects in the university your online class so what time do you take the class your schedule in the morning okay let me see you said ah i see okay i understand so you want to 
practice English every day, right? Yes. yes. So what do you want to focus? Do you want to focus on speaking, listening, reading, or writing? On, on skill. All scales, so the four scales. Okay, yes. very good. So, you want to practice English first to improve your skills, right? Yes. That's your first reason. What else? Why do you want to practice English? Like, do you want to talk with foreigners or do you want to travel abroad? So, what do you want to do also? I want to talk with a foreigners you want to talk with foreigners okay that's good or maybe also soon when you want to become a better or more skilled doctor you can also try to study in other universities abroad right right yes i have a student before she's also vietnamese but with another company. She's a doctor in Hanoi. I forgot the name of the hospital. But she studied her master's degree, I think, in Australia. So maybe when you finish your medicine course in Vietnam, you can also try to study in other countries, right? Yes. Yeah. So you really must improve your English skill. Right. Okay. So, what is the most convenient day for you to study English? Will it be Monday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, or what do you want? Weekends. So, what day do you want? Uh, I was Monday and. Monday and check on that. Uh, Wednesday. Yes. So you like uh, Wednesday. Mm -hmm. So maybe you're not busy every Wednesday, right? Okay, right. so good. So you can speak English, but you have to really practice more so that you will become fluent, okay? So when you learn English, uh, because some English learners, they would say, teacher, why it seems that it seems that my English is not improving or my English is still the same. So let me tell you this now, okay? Since you are a second language learner, so English is not your first language, so it will take time for you to become fluent. But if you practice regularly, like for example, you learn with me or every day at home, uh, for, say, 15 minutes, you listen to English songs or you read English book or you learn vocabulary, it will also help you, okay? So the key, the key to become fluent is to practice it regularly. So meaning to say, if you practice English, don't be discouraged or don't feel like sad if, for example, you cannot improve right away because it takes time. Okay? Okay. What's important is you're trying your best to improve your English skills. Okay? That's there. You can speak in English, but I'm going to help you more so that you will become fluent so that sooner or later when you finish your medicine course and you can travel abroad so you will become a fluent speaker english speaker okay 
Yes, right. Yes. Okay, so good. So for today, I'm going to end the lesson. But if next meeting, we will talk again or we will talk again soon, I want you to answer a simple question. Okay, I'll give you a question and I want you to answer it. And if we will talk again, you must tell me your answer. Okay, so this is my question for you. So what can... Oh, okay, hold on. So today, we have COVID-19. So in the future, there could be other... Future there... There might be other viruses that doctors need to, need to find. Okay. Are you willing to help other doctors? Okay. So I will type the question. And next meeting, or if we will talk again, you have to give me your answer. Okay? Okay. So. Okay. So this is the question in English. And this is the question translated in Vietnamese. Right. Okay, did you get it? This yes, one, the Vietnamese. Okay. So today we have COVID-19. So in the future, so there might be other viruses that doctors need to fight. So are you willing to help other doctors combat different viruses? So that will be your homework. And if we will talk again soon, so you will give me your answer. Okay? I will help other. You can, you can answer that next time when we talk again. Okay? Okay. okay. Thank you very much for your time today. And have a great day there in your place. Bye. Bye. Goodbye. See you again.